Moonlight began as a play by Terrell McCraney called In Moonlight, Black Boys Look Blue. We actually grew up like three or four blocks from each other in the neighborhood the movie is set in, and I never knew him growing up. Andrew Hevier, who works at Porsche, sort of said, you guys don't know each other, and this is strange, but I'm gonna give, <laughs> I'm gonna give Barry your script, because I think he would really find something to it. I read it, and right away, I was like, oh, this is really good. It just described Miami in a way that I hadn't seen uh, described before. And Terrell describes Miami as a beautiful nightmare. It was written in Terrell's voice and about his life. There are just certain biographical elements of my life and Terrell's life that just perfectly overlap. The neighborhood we grew up in, at the very least, is a very rough place, and both our mothers went through drug addiction. I need some money. For what? That's my business. Terrell is a very unique playwright, and I'm the filmmaker. I was like, you know what? Do you mind if I just take a, take a stab at this? I mean, the script just poured out of me. It was amazing. Once I was done, I shared it with Terrell. He said, uh, I will never forgive you for making this so beautiful. Which is, if you're gonna translate someone's work from one format to the next, nothing else could be a higher compliment. Thanks for the ride, man. No problem, Black. I'll see you around. James Lax, the cinematographer, and I, we said from the very beginning that we're dealing with sort of heavy subject matter, and we wanted to make a very immersive film. So there are certain times where we're taking the camera, and rather than allowing the audience to, to remain outside the film, we place the camera between actors. We want to make the audience an active participant. Where'd you go last night? Why? Well, I'm your mama, ain't I? We also wanted to have the imagery to spring forth from Miami. There's so many biographical elements in this movie. I feel like I got closer to really like bringing to life these deep memories of what it felt like to grow up in their world. 